What we want to do is change the world. Take a step back. Oh no, we need the 
the right parameter Take a step back We need a heart that bleeds for numbers Take a step back We need to invent a system that a human can toil in for decades And never seem to get any wisdom We're raising robots in an outdated model Learn when to recite the facts and learn when to follow Learn when to crumple to the will of authority But forget to love your friends unconditionally Through your telescope It's all crystal clear It's different as we travel along When they're all alone And I'm way up here Will you be there when I get home? And that, my dear, is why I have to leave you To steal back the heart of mankind the way the thieves do To gaffle the baffled minds of the masses To teach them all what this beautiful life really is Life is not being scared of your neighbors It's not shocking headlines in local papers It's not defending industry reeling onward It's not pretending having feelings is awkward Take a step back It's true that a robot could do what it is that you do Take a step back The design of Tomatons built to undermine you Take a step back but you must trust with some dumb luck and some careful introspection That a journey will lead us to love our reflections So why did I pack up and fly away? When I could be there with you as the music plays When we could be together whenever, wherever The truth is, I'd rather be remembered forever Through your telescope It's all crystal clear It's different as we travel on when they're all alone And I'm way up here Will you be there when I get home? But when I was in college I thought about what the areas that would most affect the future of humanity in my opinion And the three areas were the internet, sustainable energy and space exploration particularly if humanity becomes a multi-planet species It's kind of like a substantial bifurcation in our sort of future if we're either out there among the stars on multiple planets or if we're confined to Earth until some obviously eventual extinction event. Not that I'm pessimistic about life on Earth, I mean I think some things are likely to be good. Societies are like individuals. We grow and we challenge ourselves. We stagnate when we do not. Humans to Mars program would be a tremendously bracing challenge for our society, be tremendously productive, particularly among youth. Humans to Mars program would say to every kid in school today, learn your science and you could be an explorer of a new world. The intellectual capital from that would enormously benefit us. It would dwarf the cost of the program. Skimming thin atmosphere when I realize Everything I ever wanted sitting right before my eyes Landing safely is unlikely so let's emphasize I choose to live forever sooner than I choose to stay alive The gravity of the situation is literal But you don't see me shivering or looking pitiful I, I, I am the solitary force moving mankind onwards So call me visionary adversaries looking awkward How about now? You see my vision coming through? Nearly 15 minutes till an answer's coming through now what else you gonna do? Whatever the hell I want, my name is Hubris, man, I thought you knew. And just like that, I'm on the surface. You're welcome, seven billion earthlings for this service. And your opinion of me changes from psychotic kamikaze to one small step for a man, one giant leap for everybody. Mars is the closest planet that has on it all the resources needed to support life and therefore civilization. If we do what we can do in our time, Establish that little Plymouth Rock settlement on Mars. Then, 500 years from now, there'll be new branches of human civilization on Mars, and I believe throughout nearby interstellar space. This mission's been a successful endeavor And to make it official I've gone and done something clever Given myself an address With Mars at the end Sent you a postcard You know, something to show your friends As you pass it around You can let it sink in That your return address Now needs the word Earth in it Commonalities achieved Division nullified So if I sound at ease It's because I'm satisfied
A celebration lyric is in order, let me see now how on earth will you live up to me? I'm a Martian, marching mankind forward. You're first behind podiums, putting walls on borders. You'll never know what you got until it's gone, so you better hold her hand while I sing this song. Remember nothing lasts forever as a caldera, bro. You better fear what's sleeping under Yellowstone. I ask any American, what happened in 1492? They'll tell me, well, Columbus sailed in 1492, and that is correct. He did. But that's not the only thing that happened in 1492. In 1492, England and France signed a peace treaty. In 1492, the Borgias took over the papacy. A lot of things happened. If there had been newspapers, those would have been the headlines, not this Italian weaver's son taking a bunch of ships and sailing off to nowhere. 500 years from now, people are not going to remember which faction came out on top in Iraq. They will remember what we do to make their civilization possible. So this is the most important thing we could do. The most important thing we could do in this time. And if you have it in your power to do something great and important and wonderful, then you should. It takes you where you were, just at a higher elevation One you can fall from if you're not inclined to fly How many times I've hit the ground when aiming for the sky Shoot for the moon and if you miss, end up among the stars There's nothing inspirational about being dead on Mars Enjoy my last hurrah and all the change I made It's not like any ghost can boast this kind of dying day It's close to curtain call and for my final bow So with my last breath I must avow I feel alone the last man on earth is not hyperbole Let's zoom in on the story that is you and me If you love me dearly, would you still 
you'll come to hear me And would you die for truth or just keep living in sincerely The last man on earth is not hyperbole But zoom in on the story that is you and tell me If you love me dearly, would you still come to hear me And would you die for truth or just keep living in sincerely Forget the mission, for far too long I've been your satellite Hanging tough in upper orbit, practicing to get my greeting right Keeping you arms reach, more like a mile high Feeling dead inside when I see you with another guy So in the end, it all comes down to you You're the only person in the world I dread would disapprove Radio's delayed, I was dead before you knew I love you, I love you and economic doctrines, every hunter and forager, every hero and coward, every creator and destroyer of civilization, every king and peasant, every young couple in love, every mother and father, hopeful child, inventor and explorer, every teacher of morals, every corrupt politician, every supreme leader, every saint and sinner in the history of our species, live there on a mote of dust, suspended in a sunbeam. The Earth is a very small stage in a vast cosmic arena. Think of the rivers of blood spilled by all those generals and emperors, so that in glory and triumph they could become the momentary masters of a fraction of a dot. Think of the endless cruelties visited by the inhabitants of one corner of this pixel on the scarcely distinguishable inhabitants of some other corner. How frequent their misunderstandings. How eager they are to kill one another. How fervent their hatreds. Our posturings, our imagined self-importance, the delusion that we have some privileged position in the universe are challenged this point of pale light. Our planet is a lonely speck in the great enveloping cosmic dark. In our obscurity, in all this vastness, there is no hint that help will come from elsewhere to save us from ourselves. <laughs> 